hearing in Congress this week on energy infrastructure provided an opportunity to focus on the electric grid and specifically how to avoid the loss of power that Oklahoma and other states experienced during the big February deep freeze. Alex Cameron has more from our News on 6 Washington Bureau. Among those testifying Wednesday at the Senate Homeland Security Committee's Strategies for Improving Critical Infrastructure hearing was the COO of the Southwest Power Pool. And among those questioning him was Oklahoma Senator James Lankford. What would you say is the primary cause on the gas failure there for SVP? It was a combination of two things. Gas just simply wasn't available and or gas prices were too high. I want to know about fuel diversity mix. I want to know about winterizing some of the things that were exposed that didn't survive well. Senator Langford also wanted to know what the takeaways were for Southwest Power Pool. We are really embarking on that learning exercise right now. And one of the things that I think has got to happen, we've got to do a better job of, and that is we got to communicate more. The gas industry, the electric industry has to get together at the table. Langford says he's trying to make sure Oklahomans don't experience rolling blackouts again the next time there's a major winter event, making sure systems are winterized. Supply is not an issue, and if it is, then other systems can help out. The connectivity from one regional transmission organization to another, so from the East Coast, can we get some of that power from you? Do we have enough connectivity? We don't clearly at this point. From our Washington Bureau, I'm Oklahoma's own Alex Cameron.